is going to be part six, five, six of my uh, what I got for Christmas video. If you would like an explanation as to why I have so much stuff, um, you can see the video previous to this one, part five. So I'm going to get back to what I was saying before. I just showed um, a wine glass charm that I got with my name on it. <clears throat> The next thing, which unfortunately I cannot show you the other side, but along with that gift, they also got me a, um, where I'm from we call these koozies, a beer koozie, so this one is for cans. Um, on the other side, it has this nice design, it goes in a it's like a circular shape in that pattern and then in the middle it's got my name in blue same blue as this so my favorite colors are blue and green um, so that was cool and then to go with it also one for bottles of beer um, and I have used this one and it's exactly the same on the other side it's got this design with a, a big uh, um, it's got a big, what's the word I'm trying to say? It has my initial for my name, and then it's got my name underneath it. So that was that. So I thought that was really sweet. <clears throat> then my aunt gave me, it is a Grey's Anatomy, like, clothing brand. I think this brand, Grey's Anatomy, makes stuff for, uh, uniforms or something. For nurses, perhaps, because my sister's in nursing, and I've seen her buy things by that brand. So, anyway, my aunt sent this with my sister for me. It's green. You probably can't tell how bright. It's actually, it's looking very dull right now, but it's actually a much brighter green. Well, I don't think you can see that, but anyway. It has this nice design. It's a long sleeve, lightweight shirt. And it's kind of like through a little bit so <clears throat> she got me that to wear with jackets and things um, then my so I've explained this in several other videos over the years um, my sister's godmother lives in another state or several states away so my sister and I have different godparents that's just how I guess my parents chose to do it so my godparents are my aunt who is my dad's sister and her husband so my aunt and my uncle but my sister who's three years younger than me her godparents are my mom's best friend who lives in another state and I believe my uncle who is my dad's brother is her other uh, godparent. So even though the two of them aren't married, they're both jointly my sister's godparents. Anywho, so being that she's my sister's godmother, she also likes to spoil her a lot because um, she doesn't have children. I think it just gives her joy to buy us gifts, so I'm not going to argue with that. Um, and I would like to say I have already bought her and sent her some really nice stuff as well. <clears throat> so, the re tomorrow, or the next day, I'll show you the rest of what she got me. Right now, I only have one of the, I or, well, the peanuts were one, so two of the items that she gave me. I was not able this year to go, <clears throat> excuse me, to go and visit to um, exchange gifts with her because it was at the same time on New Year's that I was back. I live. So my parents came to visit me 
they brought the gifts that she sent for me. The rest of them are at my house. I'm at my boyfriend's house right now, and I've been too lazy, as you can see, to put away the other stuff. <clears throat> Those down there are the drink LaCroix, which are those, like, fizzy waters, or I like to say LaCroix, <laughs> as a joke. Uh, anyway, off topic. Uh, so this is one gift, which is from her. <clears throat> this is by someone called Elizabeth Cotton. They are very cool pajamas. These are in a size large, and they're actually pretty, they're not horrendously big on me, they are a little loose on me. I think I'm somewhere between like a medium and a large in this particular brand, but I don't think they make them half between medium and large, but anyway, they're really comfortable. I call these my 50s lady pajamas because they really make me think of like a movie star or someone from the 50s. So you've got this nice wide cuff, this white trim. Have a nice big pocket, nice big buttons, collar. So I just thought these were really, really awesome tried them on and they fit pretty well other than being slightly big but that's okay because they're pajamas they're really soft so those are the top <clears throat> and the bottoms have the same wide it's actually very thick if you can feel it cuff and it's got what is a pretty much like rope what this white stuff looks and feels like. And then the they look they look pretty long, but once that they're on my body they'll probably fit really well. I haven't tried them on yet. And then at the top they have a drawstring little waist. So I just thought these were really cute, comfy, very feminine, kind of old school pajamas. And she's really good about getting me gifts that I just would never think of. So, <clears throat> let's put this away. And, um, like I said, the rest of the stuff from her is at my house, and I'll show that to you tomorrow if you're not sick of me by now. And the last thing I'll show you today is from <coughs> my boyfriend's mom. I don't know how she knew I needed one. Uh, she gave me a new dish rack. This is a 16-inch dish rack. Um, the one I have is starting to get kind of beat up. I think that was really sweet of her. I haven't taken it out of here yet because I want to wait until I get it to my house. But it's got, you know, spots to put cups. Um, this is really nice that you can lay things flat on the bottom because I hate uh, having to stack cups and plates and bowls all in the same space because if some of them fall, I'm always paranoid they're going to, like, chip. And a nice big um, place for forks. So I thought that was really nice of her. This particular one is by Imperial Home. I don't know where you would buy that. Uh, but it's white. It's got a white tray. And I like that it's metal. That's pretty cool. Because it'll go with everything. So that is all I have for you for now. Hope you've enjoyed this. Um, hope you guys had a good break. Where I live, I started back to work last week, but it was snowing and we weren't able to go to work. I wasn't able to go to work because it was dangerous on the road. But um, I hope if you live like 
up north I hear there's a big storm going on or in the um, other parts of the country there's about to be some pretty bad weather and it's pretty cold here so I can only imagine how cold it is for you guys so I hope you stay warm stay safe and